Hello and welcome to Peggy's Tropical Garden. Coming to you from the Florida Keys with an international plant mail unboxing from Thailand. All right, I'm very nervous and excited about this order. I did everything contrary to what I should have and I'm just hoping for the best. I placed an expensive order with an international company I don't know in the dead of winter. What else could I have done wrong? And this package was stuck in customs in Chicago for five days. Normally, I would place a small order. After things worked out, I'd place a larger, a larger order, but I didn't do that this time. The reason being, once I paid $35 for the phyto certificate that could cover up to 12 plants with this company, um, and paid for shipping, it was so expensive that, you know, I may as well go ahead and order everything that I wanted, you know, instead of doing a small one and paying for all of that and then turning around and doing another order. So I clearly was willing to take a chance on this one. I took a gamble and I just didn't even take into consideration. It's December, it's winter. I, I just didn't even think about it. I mean, when you live somewhere where it's warm pretty much year round, it's hard to remember that other places there's snow, there's cold. And on top of that, if that wasn't enough, it's December, it was Christmas time. So of course, there's gonna be a lot more packages in the mail, things are gonna move a lot slower. None of that crossed my mind. So I'm just hoping that when I open this box, I see something green or at least some live roots that I can, you know, try and nurse back to health something. Um, but yeah, I definitely took a, a big gamble on this one and hopefully I don't lose. Okay, I think that's enough of my nervous chatter, but here we are. There's definitely some plants in here and uh, oh, from the packaging, I can't see the plants, so I can't tell what kind of condition. So where do we start? All right, moment of truth. We're going in. Let's see what we have here. Okay, this is just wrapping paper, so there's no kind of thermal foil or insulation or anything that I see from this packaging so far. I'm concerned. All right, there's green. Uh-oh, it looks like we have something alive. Thank goodness. I'm so glad. Look at this. Oh, it's definitely alive. They didn't put an invoice in the box, but I do have a copy of my um, order, so I should be able to tell what this is. The biggest thing is it's alive, and I'm so glad about that. Okay, I know exactly what this is. This is that um, Shingling Monstera, the Monstera dubia. Du uh, yeah, dubia. Um, the one that grows flat up against the tree or people put them on boards or whatever and they just the real flat leaves This looks amazing. This looks really good and it's much larger than what I expected. This is beautiful It reminds me of an exotica. Okay, and let's see what I paid. I paid nine dollars and eighty five cent for this so far so good one down six to go Oh my goodness, you have no idea how relieved I am. All right, moving on and feeling a lot more optimistic. I am so relieved. That first one looks so good, the rest of them have to at least be in decent shape. Okay, we have green, it's looking good. And I know exactly what this is. This is the variegated burl marks. These plants look so fresh. It looks like they haven't traveled at all. This one looks just as good as the last one did. I am so amazed and impressed. Seriously, there's not even a torn leaf here and there's a lot of new growth going on already. This is in excellent shape. And let's see how much I paid for this. This cost $24.95, but I'm supposed to have two of these. And it looks like the rest of the packages are smaller. So I don't know. We'll see. But look at this plant. It looks so good. I'll move this one. And afterwards, I'm going to open this one to make sure that it's not more than one plant. Because I'm supposed to have two of these. I 
I'm quite pleased so far. I mean, things couldn't have gone any better. After seeing how long they were in Chicago, I really had low expectations. Oh, here we go. This doesn't look the greatest, but I at least it gives me something to work with. This is my Thai Constellation. I expected it to be a little bigger than this, but um, the stems are alive. Hopefully the roots are fine, and I already see a small new growth. Okay, I'm supposed to have two of these also, so we'll see. But for this one, I paid $34.50, and I was hoping it would be a little bit bigger, but at this point, I'm just glad it's alive. And look at that. There's a little leaf starting to come out. So the fact that the other two are dead, hopefully we'll have another one to replace them. So far, I'm three for three, so I'm happy about that. This says it's the Hoya Sunrise that I ordered. So let's see what this looks like. I've never seen one of these except on the website, and it just looked really nice. I, I was like, yeah, let me go ahead and throw that in there. They said you could order up to 12 plants, so I didn't order that many, but I wanted to make it count so that I wouldn't have to pay for another Fido and shipping. Okay, this one is in excellent looking condition too, and the leaves are beautiful. Can you see that? They are so pretty. It's like a greenish yellow and um, brick red or something like that. But, oh, very, very pretty. I like this. I'm glad I ordered it. Oh, and the price on that Hoya Sunrise was $6.25. $6.25. Now we're on the last little plant bundle, which is kind of concerning. I ordered seven plants, and this is only plant number five. So it looks like I'm definitely missing a couple. All right, which is, oh, yay. At least I got the second Thai constellation. So that's cool. Yeah. Excellent, and this one's in better shape. This leaf isn't break falling off, although the other leaf looks like it was eaten off or something. But yeah, two tie two constellations, so I'm happy about that. But I'll have to check on my other two. I'll have to get in touch with the seller. And again, the tie constellation was $34.50. So I want to open up the roots on this uh, variegated girl marks just to see what kind of condition they're in and also to see if it's two plants because I am supposed to have two of these. From what I can see, it only looks like one, but I just want to check and make sure and see how these roots are because you can't tell what kind of condition your plant is until you've seen the roots. So let's see. Okay, the roots are wrapped in sphagnum moss and then in plastic. And the sphagnum moss is still damp. And the roots are looking good. They look like viable roots to me, so no problem here, other than the fact that it is indeed one plant. But yeah, no problems. I am impressed. In the, in the dead of winter, these plants came through looking really good. Okay, for shipping, I paid $54.50, and that was supposed to be for the seven plants. And I paid an additional $12 to have it expedited through EMS. This provided a tracking number so I could tell where my package was at all times, and I could do that through the USPS website. And then the difference that EMS made was the day that it cleared through customs, the very next day I got my plants and it cleared customs in Chicago and I'm in South Florida. So now let me correct myself. Actually, it was two days, but that is still very quick. And also the Fido sanitary certificate was an additional $35. So it was a costly venture, but a lot cheaper than it would have been purchasing these plants in the States. So as you can see, from what you pay for shipping and then for the phytosanitary certificate, it's just not worth it to order, you know, just one or two plants. That's why I went on and placed the big order. But um, to go and get a $30 plant and then pay more than that for the phytosanitary and the shipping just wouldn't make sense to me. Each time you place a plant in your shopping cart on this website, there's a statement letting you know if you don't purchase the sanitary, um, the FIDO certificate, that your plant can be confiscated. So they let you know, well, so you're well aware that if you do decide not to buy one, that your plants can get confiscated and they will not 
refund you or be responsible for it. I'm going to send them an email letting them know about the two missing plants and see what they have to say about it, um, how we're going to resolve the issue. The name of the company is AsianExport.com, A-S-E-A-N Export. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for stopping by. Bye-bye.